So translocating elephants is a, is a very complex process. So everything we do tomorrow has taken the better part of eight months worth of planning. Kester Vickery is one of the world's leading authorities on translocating elephants. So we've been catching animals for just over 20 years, and in that time, we've moved in excess of 1,600 elephants and a couple of thousand rhinos. Translocation is the process of capturing, loading, transporting, and finally releasing these massive beasts in a new habitat. Typically, you'd want to move animals as close to the point where you're catching them as possible. So this Sanav de Beers translocation that we're doing at the moment is probably the longest translocation that's ever been done. De Beers Group's Venetia Limpopo Nature Reserve has too many elephants. Over the next three years, Kesta and his team will move 200 elephants from here to Mozambique. Co-managed by the Mozambique government's Conservation Department and Peace Parks Foundation, Zanav National Park is almost 13 times as large and has almost no elephants. It's a complex operation, made more difficult by the desire to keep elephant family groups together. Because the success of the translocation is based entirely on the fact that we have a cohesive group. Elephants are, are really intelligent animals because we are moving little family herds that can talk to each other during the process of movement. If you take half a group or part of a group, they're not going to settle in Zanav. It's like a family and, and they keep very closely in the family groups. We have a responsibility to do this right here. We are always exceptionally anxious the night before we do a big project like this. This Sanav translocation is probably by far the longest translocation ever attempted. And so it was out of the box stuff to be able to move them. There are so many unknowns and the tr we never ever sleep easy the night before we do an operation like this. Ultimately, we have prepared as much as we can. To be honest, there's not a whole heap we can do now. We just need to see what cards we are dealt tomorrow. Translocation is cutting edge conservation, but it is also rife with risk. Split second decisions can have life or death consequences. The capture process itself is a, a very dynamic one. Excellent. Go on, on a helicopter is a key component in the whole thing. We need to be close, so we use a helicopter to position them to the right area, and then we use a, a dart gun. They start to the biggest, work their way down to the smallest. At a point during this, they might be darting one animal every 15 seconds. Of course, the reason why we are doing this is to keep these elephants alive. There's the helicopters, more elephants. Come on, guys, quickly. Hey, guys, pass up. 